time, when you see the same symbol, it'll relate and you'll understand what it means a lot faster. Because when people translate, they can only translate it from what they know. Because every person's symbol is slightly different. Sometimes water just means purity for a lot of people. But when the tidal wave takes away your town and you're in it or you're hiding behind a brick wall, I mean, that happened to me so many times. But it's always a warning, usually. I mean, your dreams try to help you the same as being aware of your past lives. They show mm-hmm. you all the things you went through in your life. So mm-hmm. if you keep your dream log, which I'm saying is you, you should start right now. And just put your date when you wake up, when you go to bed, how you feel. And put a note of what happened during the day. If anything different happened, you meet somebody new, a friend, an old friend. And, and just keep that together and put on the top of the page. The, the exact feeling you had because you can always relate to those feelings and then see who and what was in it and that will always help you bring a balance to that into, into what you're going through uh, I did it for years I mean it's not easy but it does help and you, see if I translate everything for you it's only what I perceive and because it's the way you think of how you relate to life how you relate to people especially your family or, or friends so it's based on that when, when you have somebody in your dream suddenly it's all people you don't know and you're in a different place. then that means the balance is you're not in balance and you have to see what's bringing you out of balance. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, but when, when you, when you're dreaming, uh, there's a lot of techniques you need to learn, like get in and out of the dream. I mean, if you're in a bad dream, you don't stay in it. How uh, do you said you're in Atlanta? I mean, what about Atlanta? Yeah. What, what about you? Atlanta? You're in Atlanta, Georgia. The I am, yes. I okay. am. Okay. Do you have uh, any groups that meet Reiki or metaphysical? Or, of course, in this 2020, we've had COVID-19, but uh, are there you just are, come and meet us here? I, I, um, I'll have to find them. Um, My, I know there are so, groups around, uh, but I'll have to find out. I'll go on the internet and do some search. Okay. Are so, you in Roswell, Georgia area? Uh, Ron stuff, about 45 uh, minutes for me. Just put something in the mail, and it, it's a bit smooth, but it looks nice on it, so she's going to keep it. <laughs> Tommy? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Okay, Tommy, Hattie, is, uh, Hattie, just come back and be in our ACO club here. You got Tommy's number. And uh, do you have an email? I do. Okay. Uh, Tommy... Uh, give her your email talks me. Blood Blood. one at AOL dot com, isn't it? But you'll have to spell it probably. <laughs> Hattie, you got a pen? H- yes, I do. The hawk, the bird. I do. H A W. Hawk. H A W K S. H A W K S. Hawk. The hawk that flies. Hawk. H A W K S. Blood, as in your body. B L O O D. B L. Hawk blood. Okay. Number one. Number one. AOL.com. At AOL. The app sign for like Gmail, but AOL.com. Yeah, he's still AOL. got AOL. 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 Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Blood, it, number one. AOL.com. Okay. Yeah, just send him an email, Hattie. Let him know that you're in Atlanta because I want us and to then, create a database because in order for us to get our church going, as a metaphysical, I, I found out we can't use the word non-denominational. And he and I are Universal Life Ministers, registered with Modesta, California, but he's in Hawaii and I'm in Florida. But we have to start getting donations in for helping people, even like a metaphysical church. So, folks, if you can, send us a donation. You can do it on PayPal to help you get psychic readings. And But we need to have your name so we can make, like, how many people would be willing to help us get this going after eight years, even though I didn't know we couldn't use non-denominational, but I know now. So I have to claim like a metaphysical church. So I filed two days ago, we got our federal ID number for Ascension Church Ohana. And then, Tommy, we're going to be metaphysicians, right, a metaphysical church. And you know how the spiritualist church in the 1800s provided uh, protection for fortune tellers. But we're going to do it for all the stuff, Tommy and I, all the 32 schools we had in Atlantis and scrying and numerology and psychometry and, you know, list all those for mentoring and coaching. But we'll help everybody set getting to know you and getting your maps going because everybody seems to be going through some kind of change in 2020 and rightfully so so things change we're all changing Hattie but uh, 
have you just stay in touch with us and listen to us hopefully on Wednesdays and Sunday, 4 to 6 p.m. Now, that's 5 to 7, Hattie. Is that okay with you in Atlanta? Five On Sundays, 5 to 7? Uh-huh. Oh, yes. Mm-hmm. That's, Good. That's, well, write that down and then see if you can encourage other people. Give them our call-in number and then tell them to like us. Uh, we've been here eight years, but I've been paying the bills. But money is getting tight, folks, so we're going to have to start – a non no, I can't say that anymore. I've got to say Ace Metaphysical and call it Ascension Church Ohana. But I've had Ascension Center Ohana for years with the federal government back to the early 2000s. So we can use Ascension Center Organization and Ace Metaphysical Institute. And it's in our articles and bylaws. I've got those listed on American Communications Online, which is my main company, folks. And Tommy and I have been using them for years and read them. So if y'all can go back on blog talk radio here you can see so we've got as far as the government's concerned a history with ascension center tommy and i here aco club ace metaphysical institute ufo association psychic network so we'll we're just hoping that y'all will support us because we didn't know we got to make a list of people <laughs> so tommy you got to help me make emails and people and list the donations because tommy and i in eight years we only had one lady send us twenty dollars once on gmail and told me to split it with him and i we just left it in there and paid one of our forty dollar bills <laughs> <laughs> but she, we do have a PayPal, folks, honest. It's just we're, you know, other radio shows Tommy and I were on, we had no problem telling them to send money in, did we, Tommy, for Re- Revolution Radio? But me and Tommy just didn't realize what all we got to do to make this work. So if y'all can help us any, we'd appreciate it. And we'll try to get ACO Club set up in every little town, and then we can have meetings and train y'all better on working some free ones on YouTube, Tommy and I can teach. And I've got a bunch of classes, and he does too. So y'all come back and listen to us. And uh, we've been here eight years, but now we're going to be a real psychic club and a real Ascension metaphysical church. Tommy's had a coven before, so it's not near to him. But we're going to do a metaphysical church now. But, of course, we do believe in God, nature's God, and big God with a big G. So we'll have stories on that. We'll have stories on the realms and the dimensions. And, Tommy, I did a really cool little thing. Tommy, did you find that teaching one on YouTube? Folks, I want you, Hattie, I want you to go look at it. One of his first teachings that I finally, after eight years, I kept telling him, I want to do something. I want to do something on realms. So if you go, Tommy, did you, did you pull it up? Yeah, I watched it. Yeah, it's, it's is, uh, is it the one with the drums or without the drums you watched? One uh, doesn't without speak. The drums. Oh, you watched. Right, okay, is speak, that yeah. the one with your picture on it? Let me yeah. let me see if I can find it. Well, okay, in my history. A lot of different pictures come up. Okay, uh, let's see, folks. I want you, I want to start educating you to be part of our Ascension Church Ohana Metaphysician Spiritual Science. Now it comes up on Spreaker, and we're on Spotify and iHeart, all the places. I pay lots of money out actually every month just to get us distributed. So if you talked on the show, you're part of the show. So Speaker Spreaker. But uh, we're going to build this, and we're going to start working on getting a database of people with their email and what they can help us with a donation like and give you all more help to be self-sufficient and help you on using tools to help yourself because they're out there. It's just how much do you want to believe and how much do you want to map and have tools. And we have Reiki and psychometry and tarot reading and uh, obviously uh, – even water witching and using the L rods, which is what Jenny does, and then helping people find other people and then being very intuitive and helping you find your places you want to live and just helping everybody. We're going to do a lot more. Well, Tommy, do you have anything else you'd like to say? Because uh, you do it. Tell them about your show on Tuesday live, and then uh, Wednesday we'll come back. Go ahead. Well, Tuesday I, I do a show. Because uh, you do tell them about your show on Tuesday live. Where's that coming from? People come back. I have no clue. That's weird. Right. Somebody got me. Somebody recorded it and it's playing it back. Where's that coming from? Huh. 
on. <laughs> I'm g- let me go to see here. <laughs> well, okay, somebody, let me go find somebody that. that's listening to the show is still on. TJ, oh, somebody okay. that's still listening to the show. I think they've turned it off. There's always a time delay. Oh, There's okay. There's somebody on the show. Now they'll be recorded. <laughs> well, fo- yeah. folks, usually I'll try to post upcoming shows, but if I don't, if if I'm showing up late, it's just technical problems. But I'm I'm switching from eight to ten at night Eastern, uh, which is seven to nine Central. I'm gonna go for the winter months at least uh, five, uh, four to six. That's five to seven Eastern. For all you regulars that like to call in and either be a part of the show, ask a question, or get a reading with me and Tommy. But Tommy and I are going to start training you guys. And he's got his first episode one series. Wait, series one. Anyway, it's a, it's a class on how he talks about rims. And I want to do number two, Tommy, follow up. So send me the lines. You know how I did? Not any more or less. That was pretty good. Uh, for Tommy, but Tommy, I can't find it, so I'll have to find them and send them to you. Did you post them on your channel? Those teaching YouTubes. All right. Well, did you want me to go on about Tuesday first? Yeah. Now that I can hear you, go ahead. All right. Uh, Tuesday, I I do a show. It's early my time, uh, but she's in London, so England, and it's a lot different. But we, we talk about everything in the UFO world. Uh, we do have information, the latest information we can. She's going through a lot of stuff from being abducted and still is. So we're, we're, we're on the top of the line as far as abductees go. Most of the stuff on abductees isn't live and real and up to date. Uh, so if you're really interested in that, at any level, tune in. Uh, we do stuff in the UFO. Oh, you're dropping off, and Tommy. We can what was it? You just dropped off or bent. I don't know what you did. It was I didn't do nothing. I just stand right here. Uh, okay. Well, as I know, they've been having a lot of problems with phones. Uh, Everywhere it's, during it's this. Really uh, exactly. I don't, it's because so many people are home and using it. They tell me. Plus, they're rewriting code uh, between Google, Microsoft, Verizon, TiVo, all the different big companies. They're, they're in over their heads, and so they're having to – Rewrite it. Plus, it bends because everybody's using it. It's making the bandwidth thin out. It, it, it's not. I mean, it's unfortunate, but it's really hard for all of us in communications, folks, and on phone companies. So, give us some time between all the Verizon and AT and T and Sprint and T-Mobile and all of those with different companies. Well, Tommy, we've only got a few minutes left, uh, folks. You can join us. ACO Club or Ascension Center, you can go to AmericanCommunicationsOnline.com. My name's Teresa. I've got TeresaJMorris.com, Tommy. Uh, and I will be back here Sunday. And then we, you can look for us on YouTube, Tommy Hawksblood, Hawksblood1, Thomas Anthony Sneesey. He goes by Tommy Hawksblood Sneesey on Facebook. So look him up. And mine's TJ Morris Agency. My Teresa Morris is pretty much filled up, but I've got Teresa J. Morris, Teresa J. Thurmond, T-H-U-R-M-O-N-D Morris, and the reason is so many of my social media for all those years on my Gmail accounts were filling up with people, and they'd only let us have 5,000, so anyway, I started a bunch, but now I can't find them all, <laughs> so, but people have me about 10 of my faces on different ones, but Tommy, I'm sorry uh, we missed each other, but we'll do Tuesday, and then Tommy, how about 4 to 6 Wednesday, is that okay? You're on mute. Sounds good. Okay. Sounds good. All right, Tommy, and then uh, two people should email you or call you, but write their names down and then ask them to come back on Wednesdays and the Sundays. And, folks, we'll come right. back, and then hopefully on Thursdays I may show up and do some readings too, Tuesday or Thursday, but for sure Wednesday and Sunday. So look for TJ Morris ET Radio, American Communications Online, and Teresa J. Morris is TJ, and Tommy is Thomas Hawksblood Sinisi on Facebook. And we'll keep uh, trying to do what we can, and we love helping people coach. And we'll be making videos, so look for our YouTubes too, please, on American Communication.